today I'm in Guru Graham and I'm gonna be riding the Rapid Metro. That's not it, but we're heading there now. Behind me is the Huda City Central Metro and we're headed to the Rapid Metro, which isn't too far away. The Rapid Metro is a light rail system in Guru Graham that was first proposed in 2005 to help the city's growing transportation needs. This is the first privately funded metro rail system in India. We're about 40 minutes outside of uh, Delhi and we can see if we wanted to take it in, we could go right downtown. I need to go to Sikh and Pur towards the Rapid Metro. The Rapid Metro is equipped with advanced technologies and features, including signaling and communication systems, automatic train protection, and my favorite, air-conditioned trains. It's also a green transportation option with energy-efficient trains and future initiatives that will help reduce carbon emissions. Overall, though, it's just a smooth ride and a nice break from the busy traffic. I'm in the ladies' car, but nobody's here. We can leave if the, a lot of ladies come. The Rapid Metro connects key areas of Guru Graham, including the Business District, Guru Graham University, and several residential neighborhoods. It has 11 fully air-conditioned stations with ticket vending machines to quickly buy your ticket. There's also a feeder system that connects DLF Phase 3 station to the Guru Graham bus station, and it runs from 6 a.m. to 10 p.m., with trains coming every few minutes during the main hours. I booked my Airbnb near the metro station so that if I wanted to go into Delhi, I easily could do that. Sikandarpur Station. We are going to change here for the Rapid Metro. This is one of the original metro stations out here in Guru Graham. The Rapid Metro has 11 stations and it covers 11 kilometers. Since 2013, it's carried over 3 million passengers and over 30,000 per day. Today, I'm one of them. I've been using the metros around India and I found them super convenient, easy way to get around. I try to stay near one so then I can get around the city pretty quickly. You can check out my reviews on Delhi's full metro, Bangalore, Chennai, Hyderabad, and more. Aside from them being a comfortable ride for myself, they're also good for the air. They reduce emissions, help take uh, some, <laughs> some cars off the road. I have a surprise for you about halfway through, so make sure to stick around. quite sure where I'm going here. So we have Sikandarpur, that's where we're at. And then we go to phase two, phase three, Mool Sari Avenue, I think. Or Cyber City, that's another mall. Belvedere Towers is the main place in Guru Graham. So we're coming up on Cyber City Station, one of the best malls. I did a video about that if you want to check it out. Had some good food. I've always liked that uh, if it's a hot day, all the cars are air conditioning. So you can get a little reprieve from the heat. Although now it is super cold. It cost me a total of 60 rupees for my first ride. About $1. Now let's do a quick surprise. I'm gonna do a video on the most, the biggest mall here in Guru Graham and the fifth biggest mall in India. On the small, okay, 50. 50. 50. Oh, okay. Back to the old school ways of doing things. <laughs> Headed back to the metro after the mall. Let's see how it is at night. Back to the Rapid Metro, nighttime. I'm not going too far. I gotta get from the Rapid Metro to the yellow line, back to home. Let's do this. Five minutes, sector 50. 
five. Okay. I think that's the opposite direction. Muzalari, Cyber City, Sikander Purr. Okay. So it's gonna go this way. It's nighttime, so if someone tries to rob me, emergency help phone. Press button to contact control center in emergency. I imagine the Rapid Metro is going to continue to improve in the future, so if you're coming to India, check it out. Future initiatives might include automated ticketing systems, real-time passenger information, more feeder systems, and an expanded parking options if you need to park your rickshaw. And I went here last year as well. I went ice skating and took a tour of Cyber City. Sikandar Port Station, then we're heading back to the yellow line. I know my way. Huda City, I got a Airbnb right by the metro station. I barely used it, but it's nice to know I could go pretty much anywhere in Delhi with a 10 minute walk to the metro. the city center the final destination if you've enjoyed the video please click the like button help the video go out to more people let me know if i should do more metro videos I'm gonna be going to kerala sometime soon probably another place with the metro so tune in next week i'm going to goa we'll probably be in a video coming soon